The family of Abu Bakr Shahid, who was shot dead in war by the Upper West Regional Police Anti Robbery Unit on Thursday, March 9, is still in grief. <laughs> They refused to accept the assertion by the regional police command that their son was an armed robber. The deceased was reportedly on his way to his employer, but was shot dead by the police. A brother of a deceased, Isa Isahaku, reportedly collapsed and died when news about his brother's death was announced. One would have thought that under standard policing procedure, resort to the use of arm would never be the first option. However, it becomes evident that our men in uniform are becoming trigger happy. The family hereby demand and petition that the police should accept their mistake, show remorse and apologize to the family for unjustifiably taking the life of their member. The police should also reach out to the family and take steps to find an amicable solution to the matter. The interior minister, the IGP, the regional minister, the MCE, for what should constitute an independent committee to probe into the matter and any police officer found culpable should be duly sanctioned. Mma Zainab Abubakari is the mother of a deceased. I was anticipating Shahid's homecoming to care for his ailing father. He was very dedicated and diligent. The family and I are deeply saddened by his passing. Shahid was responsible for feeding and bathing his ill father. The father has been inquiring about his whereabouts ever since he died. We had no idea how to inform him of the situation. My son never committed a crime. The cops must accept responsibility for their actions. They need to remove the innocent man's criminal record and apologize to us. The deceased has since been buried in accordance with Islamic tradition.